guys, it's Lee, and I am back today with a brand new subscription box. Before I get started, this box was sent to me in exchange for a review, and I am not getting paid to do this video. So I was super excited when they reached out to me and asked me if I wanted to unbox the Error Wrap box. The Error Wrap box is the first ever subscription-based box that sends Armenian goodies worldwide. And I'm really excited to find out what's in this box and to learn more about the Armenian culture. So let's open it up. This box does come in two different sizes. This is the 2kg box, which is just under four and a half pounds. And then there is a 1kg box, which is just over two pounds. If you're interested in finding out more about the pricing and sizing of the two boxes, then just click the link I will have down in the description box below. It's not an affiliate link or a referral link. It's just a link directly to their website. So first they sent me this little note thanking me for agreeing to do the video. It's a difficult time for the Armenian economy and we do our best to support small businesses by exporting their products and introducing them to the world. Oh, here are some stickers that were in that uh, booklet. Very cool. I like them. And then it comes with this booklet that says Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. And this is the December 2020 box. So this book just goes through all the products. And then in here it has the success stories of our vendors. Very, very cool. All right, so let's, let's open this up and see what's inside. So the first item in the box that I'm seeing is one of my all-time weaknesses, caramel popcorn. So I'm just going to show you in the book where it shows the caramel popcorn, tells you who it's made by, a little bit about the product, the flavor is sweet, it's vegetarian, and if there are any health benefits. So I think that's really pretty cool. And like I said, this is a weakness of mine, so I'm definitely going to be trying this out. Oh look, there's a little doll in here. She's cute. This is what it looks like. Mmm, so good. I love caramel popcorn. Definitely, definitely. It's one of my faves. That is very tasty. So I think that these are only in the larger 2kg boxes, but they do include souvenirs. And this is a little traditional Armenian girl doll. And it's made by Alda Dolls. And it says you can make her stand on your bookshelf by opening her little dress. Oops. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Isn't she adorable? I love that. That is so cute. She's adorable. Also, I was just reading in the booklet that you get stickers in this box every month as well. So, very cool. If you've been watching my channel, you know that I am... Um, kind of addicted to stickers. All right, so let's go here. This is crackers with cheese. Crispy chunks of bread resembling small bruschettas or bruschettas, sorry, are the best quick snacks. All right, these are vegetarian and they are nacho cheese flavored. This is what they look like. They're super crunchy. And they're really good. I don't detect a lot of flavor, cheese flavor, I mean. And I don't taste nacho at all, but they are tasty. I do like them. Yummy. They're like really crunchy breadsticks. All right, so next is oops, persimmon frips. And I don't know what a frip is, but it looks like dried persimmons maybe. So I'm going to try these. I've never had a persimmon. It says they're sweet and that they are vegetarian. And this is what they look like. That's really good. That is tasty. I, like I said, I've never had persimmons before. But I like this. Mm, I'm going to hide these from everybody else. Mm-hmm. Good stuff. One thing I didn't mention, which I probably shouldn't have to mention, but I'm going to, 
all of these products are made in Armenia. So just so you know. This next pro product is Armenian tea. Oh, I'm gonna butcher the name. Anmaruk, A-N-M-O-R-U-K. Oh, that's the brand, sorry. And this tea has black tea, cinnamon, and mandarins. So it sounds amazing. I can't wait to try it. it smells really good too. That smells amazing. Next, there is a candy cane. But in here it's called a Christmas lollipop, so there's a candy cane as well. Next is this chocolate bar with walnuts. I cannot try this because of the walnuts, but it's a bar of milk chocolate with walnuts. And it said, what can make better company with your coffee break at the workplace? So yeah, this looks really amazing. So next I pulled out of the box this Mendiants. I'm not sure if I'm saying that correctly, but they are small chocolate discs studded with nuts and dried fruit. I'll try one of the ones with the almonds in it. Mmm, that's good. That's delicious. The chocolate is so good. It's white chocolate. It's really good. These will disappear quickly in my house as well. All right, let's see what's in here. Oh wow, it's a lot of these. Quite a few of these. And they are chocolate covered dry fruits. So there are different flavors. This one is chocolate covered dried fig with walnuts. I can't try that one. Chocolate covered cherry with hazelnut. Oh, this is a chocolate covered apricot with walnuts. I love dried apricots. And then this one is chocolate covered dried prune with almond. This one I can try. That's what it looks like. Mmm, that's good. I really like dark chocolate, so. Oh, that's tasty. So next in the box are these fruit food, apricots and cherry sour lavashes. I don't really know what a lavash is. I've never really heard of it. It says sour lavash is one of the oldest desserts. Armenians used to eat it even well before the spread of chocolate. It looks like a fruit roulette and is made of apricots, prunes, cherries, or apples. All right, let's try this one. It looks like an apple. what it looks like. It tastes like root leather. Mmm, it's good. It's tasty. Oh, it's sour. I mean, it's not so sour. I just am kind of a wimp when it comes to sour. Yeah, that's good. It's so nice to try treats and snacks from other countries, especially right now since we can't go anywhere. All right, so the next item I see is called locums, L-O-K-H-U-M-S, with pistachios and apricot sheets. I have no idea. I've never heard of these before. I had it upside down. And this says, this is a delight stuffed with nuts and surrounded by layers of dried apricot. They are individually wrapped. This is what it looks like. It's kind of jelly in the middle. Let's see if I can break. See that? It's like a jelly in the middle. Sticky. It's really good. So what I did was I tasted some of the outside and then some of the jelly. That is really, really tasty. I love that. Yum. Two thumbs up for that. All right, let's see what's in this bag. These are salted apricot kernels. Breaking apricot stones is what follows eating the fruit in Armenia. Children like doing it outside with stones. So these are actually, I didn't even know that you could eat uh, the apricot stones. I guess you are seeds, pits. You break them and this is what's inside. 
that's what it says. So yeah, I'm gonna try this. And this is a salty snack. They look like. Like this, and I guess you just pop it in your mouth and bite it. So I think they're kind of like sunflower seeds. You break them open and eat what's on the inside. Yeah. Oh, that's good. Mmm. That's really tasty. I didn't even know that was a thing. They're super salty, though. You couldn't eat very many of them just because of the salt, but it does taste good. Yum. All right. So here we have some more of the lavashes. This is Acos or Acos, A-K-O-S, sour lavash. And they are in peach flavor. So the last ones I tasted, because I'd never heard of lavash before, reminded me of fruit leather. All right, so I broke off part of it and I'm gonna give this, give this a try. It's very tasty. It's basically a really, 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 really chewy fruit leather, but it's good. I like it. Let's see what we have here. This is apricot hot chocolate. It says hot chocolate at home, and I guess you just put it in some warm milk, and it dissolves and makes hot chocolate. Very cool. What are these? These look interesting. These are called Apache Chili Crackers. Well, these are chili and these are cheese. So I'm gonna try the cheese ones because I don't really wanna try the chili ones. So they're big rectangular crackers, but they're broken. So I'm just gonna try this piece. Mmm, tastes like real cheddar cheese and not that phony cheese flavor. They're so good. Mmm, mm -hmm. I love those. So what do we have next? Um, this is packaged really well. <laughs> and this is honey with the honeycomb. And according to the booklet, the flowers are from the Armenian Alpic mountains and fields and that this is 100% natural with no additives. So yeah, I look forward to trying that. I love honey. It'll be good in the tea, maybe. All right, so what do we have here? Oh, this looks like dried apples. Oh, it is dried apples. I love dried apples. These are dried apples spiced with cinnamon. I'm gonna open them up and try them. This is what it looks like. So good. Mm -hmm. I love dried fruit. These are very tasty. All right, so the next item was this Armenian paklava, and I cannot try this because it has walnuts in it. You'll never forget the rich taste of this sweet layered pastry with topped walnuts and honey syrup on top. Sounds amazing. I just wish that, you know, it was like almonds or something that I could actually eat, but I know my son will eat this because he loves this kind of stuff. And the last item in the box, and this box has had quite a few items in it, whoops, is this Armenian coffee. Coffee is undoubtedly the most favorite beverage in Armenia. And that this company was created by coffee lovers and that it's basically like an art form for them. Okay guys, so that was everything that was in the December Ararat box. So if you or your family is maybe of Armenian heritage or like me, you just love trying snacks from around the world, click that link down below and go check them out. I know you won't be disappointed. This is the 2kg box, just so you know. I think there are 18 to 20 snacks in there plus a little goodie, a treat each time. This is a monthly subscription box or you can just buy one box if that's what you want to do but I really think you'll enjoy it. So make sure you go check them out. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the little bell so you don't miss out on any of my upcoming videos. You can also find me over on Instagram, Twitter, and Pinterest at Lee's Home 5 Thanks for watching.
Bye. Thank you.